Hey guys, so this video is a little bit different. Uh, basically, it is one of my many English assignments and it is an analytical vlog, a comparison between Macbeth and Breaking Bad. So for about a year now, I've been wanting to do like vlogs. My full name is Ariana Mara Marie Zabalgieri. <laughs> and that's what we're doing. We're going sightseeing. Get pumped. Say hi to the vlog, Chloe. The vlog? Yes. <laughs> the human condition. Is it really timeless and can it be compared between a classical and contemporary text? William Shakespeare's tragic play Macbeth and Vince Gilligan's 2008 television series Breaking Bad both portray the human condition of greed. Both texts explore how the protagonists, Macbeth and Walter White, are controlled by greed through the ideas of unchecked ambition, I want to own all of these, corruption of power, and death by ignorance. Gilligan and Shakespeare recognise how greed can cause unchecked ambition within the protagonist of the text. Walter White is a good chemistry teacher with an unfortunate diagnosis. Lung cancer. Inoperable. Best case scenario, maybe I'll live another couple of years. Comparable to Walter, Macbeth is faced with a prophecy that would change his life. Through the motif and foreshadowing of fair is foul and foul is fair, Readers understand that the prophecy of Macbeth's future as king hereafter will be a downhill slope. Walter White and Macbeth are forced to prove their manhood because no matter the situation they're in, a man provides. And he does it even when he's not appreciated or even loved. He simply bears up and does it because he's a man. Estimating that 737,000 would be enough to support his family Walter turns to cooking meth and keeping it a secret. To look like the innocent flower but be the serpent under it is a simile describing Walter's actions and foreshadowing Macbeth's intentions to kill the king and take his place. Through having unchecked ambition, both protagonists find that tasting a little bit of power isn't enough. They are not in danger, but they are the danger. Throughout Macbeth and Breaking Bad, the characters have a large concern in upholding their reputation and power, which results in their corruption, a large concept of the human condition. Walter White and Macbeth are metaphorically described as being in blood, stepped in so far that should I wade no more, returning were as tedious as I go over. When did I step in tomato sauce? Using this metaphor, the audience understands that there is no possible way that the characters can correct their choices, and they may as well continue. Uh, I'll just clean it later. Macbeth and Walter White are now at the top of the food chain, and the unpredictable and deceitful nature of the characters is analysed by the audience using the quote, There's no art to find the mind's construction in the face. What? Wanting more power and more money, they push out their loved ones and feel invincible. Macbeth is convinced that none of woman born shall harm, and Walter White threatens his opponents by telling them to tread lightly. By becoming corrupted by power, the protagonists become ignorant and face a downfall, a key part of the human condition of greed. Not every text has a happy ending, and this is no different to Macbeth and Breaking Bad as both characters find that their ignorance leads to their downfall and death. Feeling confident that Macbeth shall never vanquish, be until Great Burnham Wood to hide Dunsinane shall come against him, Macbeth goes out onto the battlefield to kill his enemies, despite Shakespeare foreshadowing that he beware of Macduff. The audience is reminded that the protagonists are not invincible, and just because you shot Jesse James don't make you Jesse James. Just like Macbeth, Walter White creates a plan to take back his money, but both characters don't think about the practicality of these plans. 
Parallel to Walter, Macbeth also foreshadows his death on the battlefield, quoting that this push will cheer me ever or deceit me now. At the end of both texts, it's apparent that the protagonists do not care about other people's opinions and believe that they will never be caught or have any fears of their impending downfall and death. Throughout the classical text of Shakespeare's Macbeth, and the contemporary text of Gilligan's Breaking Bad, the idea of greed is explored. Using this idea, both texts support that the human condition is indeed timeless. Its relevance throughout history and current times contributes to the development of the protagonists, as both find themselves with unchecked ambition, corrupted power and ignorance. Well, that's the end of the video. And you know how they say that it's been a pleasure? Well, it hasn't. So yeah, that's the end of the video, um, I don't know what I'm being marked on this, like what my grade will be, but yes, uh, I've got a vlog coming up soon after this one, and it is on the Pride March in Darwin, so that's coming up soon, and also, we hit 30 subscribers i think maybe a week or two ago so thank you so much it's amazing let's keep growing this channel together i'm having so much fun making videos for you and for myself because like let's be real videos are fun to make <laughs> and i bought this camera so better make the most of it so yeah i'll see you in the next vlog i guess out see ya